What's going on, everybody? Here is your weekly recap for week 16. This week, our skating theme of the week was Mohawks, and our gameplay theme of the week was passing and fake passing, uh, and more specifically then combining that skating theme of Mohawks with the passes and fake passes. So for the stick handling drill, um, a nice, simple, simple one with just a straight line of pucks and just toe drag central, really trying to not only work on you know the toe drag itself, but the move that sets up the toe drag, that move up before you then drag the puck underneath. Uh, a lot of students did really well with that one this week. Our acceleration and speed with the puck drills, both focusing on the Mohawks, the hits facing in and the hits facing out, how to explode and get speed when you're executing that so that we could then use that uh, later on in the session with our two gameplay uh, drills. The shooting uh, drill this week was a bit of a challenge for a lot of students. It was load and shift shots coming around your proper wing side and load and shift uh, backhand shots from your off wing side, but trying to take those out of your crossovers. So it was a three shot drill, crossing over around the circle, load and shift out of the cross without gliding on two feet, picking up another puck, then a Mohawk fake pass into load and shift again without gliding on two feet, shooting from one leg to the other, and then a reverse Mohawk. Single cross only shooting out of the cross, the exact same way as the first shot, but coming from that reverse Mohawk. A lot of students find that challenging. I'm finding that more and more players are, are shooting off leg from a younger age and not working on that load and shift or open hip, uh, which is the stride leg release. A lot of player uh, coaches and stuff refer to it as a stride leg release. But basically, if you're a righty, shifting from your right leg to your left, or if you're a lefty from your left leg, to your right so uh, in the homework section we've got some shooting work shooting homework to help with that similarly the stick handling homework has toe drag work to help with that everything connected to the, the, the in the homework is connected to the themes that we did this week now our last two drills the gameplay drills we were working on spin passes and of course spin passes relates to mohawks because when you fake that spin pass that is your your mohawk hit footwork so we were doing spin passes and for some of the more advanced groups also the uh, fake spin pass into spin pass the other way. And our final gameplay drill, picking up the puck uh, out of the corner into Mohawks right away. When you go into Mohawks right away, when you're picking up the puck, it allows you to see the entire ice. Now you can see that spot that would be a little bit more behind you if you picked it up traveling forwards. Um, so going into the Mohawk, and then you have two men in front that are open, one D trying to cover both. And you're trying to make a quick pass uh, to whoever's open from those Mohawks. 